be a yes for you, for him? Yeah, it's a yes. And it's a yes for you, for her? It's a yes for me. Yeah, we got a match! <laughs> <laughs> All right, you two can go on off. Right, I'll take on. this mic. Yeah, there you go. Hey, let's make some noise, guys! <laughs> moment you know everyone's always waiting to hear about since you guys matched on the show yeah has there been a day have y'all gone anywhere or any of that good stuff serenity you want to answer i was going to ask you but no we did not go on a date we did not go on a date we did not go on a date um right after we wrapped the shoot we we did go to the club with a handful of people okay and it was hard to have a conversation in the club. Yeah, I bet. Uh, <laughs> but he seems like a really great guy. But um, I will say after the show went live, mm -hmm. I mean, I've been getting a mass amount of just inquiries for my business. Um, and then also there's a lot of guys out there applying pressure. They're applying pressure. They're applying pressure. It's time for us to have a discussion. Pull up a chair. Because we need to talk about what exactly does it mean when a woman says apply pressure. They're applying pressure. We've heard it in the videos. We've heard it on dating videos. We've heard it on dating segments. And we've heard it on social media. But women have never been clear about what that means to apply pressure. Yep. You've heard of love bombing. You've heard of everything under the sun. But now this new fad about applying pressure. What does it mean, ladies? What's going on, everybody, and welcome back to another video. Don't forget, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, tickle that notification bell that will let you know every time I upload content, you know what we're going to do. Yep. Roll that clip. Mm. And you either applying the pressure or you feeling it, and I wasn't getting that from Adit. Mm. Huh? Mm. Yeah. Okay, what's going on? Oh, she threw back at me. <laughs> Hey, uh, we did go out after that, you know, and as she said, it was the club and mm -hmm. it's too noisy. You know, we right. caught up a little bit, you know, family, you know, uh, basic questions about, you know, profession, personal interests and likes. Mm -hmm. And I did uh, try to schedule a date for the following weekend right before the episode dropped. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it happened that she was, you know, she works out, she works late on Fridays and it was either a Saturday or a Sunday and she... She had something to do on Saturday and she had a friend's birthday to attend on Sunday. So I just, I told her, you know, I know you're busy, I'm busy as well. Just let me know when, when your schedule opens up and I'll be happy to take you on a date. Okay, so did the schedule open up and you, have you hit him up? No. Got him. We fucking got him. <laughs> okay, what happened? Why not? <laughs> um, there just have been a few other guys applying that pressure and- A bullshit? A bullshit? A bullshit? A bullshit? A bullshit. Um, once you allow so much time to pass, it just kind of falls by the wayside. I, like I said, I do appreciate a guy who's showing interest and applying that pressure mm -hmm. and kind of won't leave me alone, mm. in a sense. How about new? So and you want him just, to keep trying? Just apply pressure. If you were really interested and this isn't, this wasn't for like a clout experience yeah. or an opportunity to push your business, mm -hmm. like, okay, try again. This is the issue that I see in dating. Men are applying pressure. We are getting to know you. We are extending a hand and saying, do you want to go out? What's your schedule? What are you doing? I really think it's women that want the gratification of immediate attention from multiple men that are applying pressure. You have to understand the type of man that you're going to get that's applying pressure is not the kind of man that you want anyway. Yep. The men that have time to sit around and apply pressure 
are men that have nothing going on for themselves, nothing to do, no life, and their life revolves around you anyway as a woman. He ain't lying. So which do you want? Do you want a good quality man that's going to be everything you need? Or do you want this guy over here to the left to apply pressure? See, this guy said he did try to schedule the date, but it's the woman that didn't want to follow up. Did the schedule open up? And you, have you hit him up? No. 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 <laughs> <laughs> no have you ever been there guys have you ever been with a woman and you trying to schedule a date and you hear nothing i'm gonna give you some game that i've given in multiple videos if a woman likes you you don't have to apply pressure if you're applying pressure this woman is just not into you. Yeah. You don't have to apply pressure, call her multiple times, try to get her to come out on a date, try and get her schedule free. If a woman really likes you fellas, she will clear her schedule for you without you even having to ask. See, these women that say apply pressure, more than likely, they're looking for instant gratification and a bunch of men in her inbox. But he seems like a really great guy. But um, I will say after the show went live, mm -hmm. I mean, I've been getting a mass amount of just inquiries for my business. Um, and then also there's a lot of guys out there applying pressure. <laughs> They want you to apply pressure, but then when you apply the pressure, nothing happens. So you put the ball in the woman's court and the woman doesn't even respond. Did the schedule open up and you, have you hit him up? No. But then she turns around and says, oh, you need to apply pressure. Absolutely not. If a woman likes you, no pressure is needed. Notice what she said, guys. You have to approve. You have to prove yourself. You have to apply pressure. You have to prove yourself to me. Why does a man, ladies, have to prove himself to you when he's already doing it? He's already applying pressure. He's already scheduling a date. He's already doing what he needs to do as a man to get your attention. Why does he need to do more? It's your job as a woman to reciprocate. He ain't lying. That is what we are looking for in the dating market as a man. When we reach out, we're looking for a one simple thing, reciprocation. Are you reciprocating what we're giving you? When we text you, are you texting back or are you making excuses? When we call you, does it go to voicemail and we never get a call back? Or when we call, do you pick up the phone? When we want to hang out and get to know you and take you out, are you ghosting us? Or are you reciprocating our efforts? See, men of today's dating world, we're tired of modern women. We're tired of applying pressure because it's not needed. Like I said earlier, if a woman truly and genuinely likes you, she will open doors for you to hang out. She will drop everything. She will drop everything to hang out with you. She will make it a point to make it so that you can get to know her if she really likes you. Fellas, I'm going to give you this. If a woman is telling you to apply pressure, move on. Don't waste your time because you shouldn't have to apply pressure if the woman likes you. If the woman genuinely likes you, your presence is enough. Your mere presence and being around her is enough. If she really genuinely likes you, that's it. So fellas, don't be out here giving a woman pressure. Don't fall for the okie doke. You don't need to give a woman pressure. What you need to do is 
if the woman is not on your program, you don't need her. Period. You don't need her. Anyway, y'all, that's been it for today's video. Don't forget, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, tickle that notification bell. That will let you know every time I upload content, you are going to see me right after this in the next video. Peace.